Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vian, in case you didn't know. And my mom and dad have ordered me a Kimiko Science Experiment Kit. I'm so excited to build it, I mean make it, because it is ages nine to 13 and I'm only seven. So let's get started. Guys, all of the materials are in here. Whoopsie, they're not here. They're on this table. So let's get started. was to cover all of the holes with clear tape. So I did that, so let's look what the second step is. Take the paper guy and put it in the center of the box. Take the sticky foam donut and put it in the center of the left cor bottom corner. So then you have to put it inside of the hole that was made inside of the guy. This is a motor and this is another black sticky foam donut. So we have to put this on the bottom of the motor. So it lines up like this, just as so. Then put the motor through the blue stick donut and Put the, make the wires go through the left hand notch. Secure the wires with the red sticky foam tape in two places. One, two. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited. It's so interesting already. Are you guys excited? Okay, guys, there are eight holes in this wooden disc. So. You see these places where there are like lines? I will be keeping four of these in four of those places. So it looks like this. And then you just simply throw this away. Bye bye. So we will be taking this sticky tape off the plastic gear. And we will be removing it and putting it right in the center of the back side, like this, but on the other side. Take the wooden plate and secure it, secure it with the gear in the box so it can spin. Ooh. This is the paint guard and we're gonna put it in between the box. And you see these, these are stickers. So when it stands up, this will be like this and it will stick to the side. So let's do that. Look guys, the paint guard is done. So there'll be more things for us to do. It'll be so fun. It's already so fun. Guys, this is a breadboard. Does it look like bread to you guys? Let me see. I'm just joking, it's not that kind of bread. It is electronic used breadboard. So there will be these small, small resistors. This is a teeny weeny resistor. So if my dad was driving this car really fast and my mom says to slow down, slow down, she's acting like a resistor. So this breadboard that you saw earlier and the holes in it, I will put one or two resistors inside one of the holes that it says on the instructions. So let's do this. I'm gonna stick the breadboard through the holes. Now I'm going to put the battery in and make sure the negative side goes to the negative side and the positive side goes to the positive side. So now I'm going to open.
So now I'm going to put the battery where I kept the, kept the breadboard too. Just like this. Now push it down a little, push it down a little, push it down a little, push it down a little. So we got that done. So now we're going to stick it onto the box. I placed the circuit board on my box. So you see this, I put it like that so it'll stick like that. So the red wire of the motor and the red wire of the battery, they will stick together and the other black wires will go into the breadboard like that one on the top and one on the bottom you guys want to see the magic and the resistors help it to keep it not that slow but slow so you guys want to see the magic yeah i want to see the magic look up top and when i turn it off it will go off I'm going to conduct the experiment. As you see, I have four paint colors. Orange, blue, yellow, and green. And I have one paper. I will stick the paper inside. So when this spins, all the colors will be splashing and looking like this. It will look beautiful. is ready so now I'm gonna turn it on while while this is closed though so it doesn't splash everywhere when we when it comes so let's close the box and after 30 seconds we'll see how it looks like and then I'm gonna turn it on now okay. guys let's slowly open it That's how it looks like. This time we've done it in a pattern way, but we're gonna do it in a slower speed. So I'm gonna turn it on right now. Three, two, one. That's a slower speed. Let's see how it looks like. Whoa. It's looking so cool. Guys, we completed it. And these are the all four that we made. This is my favorite. What's your favorites? Comment down below. But I have a question. Why is it not go the lines not going in circles in lines? Hmm. Centrifugal force is the cause why the paint is going in lines. That's what makes it beautiful. So stay tuned and like, subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for the next amazingly fun science experiment. Bye!